Welcome back everybody to the Giddy Scrapper. Today, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and process this little motor I was telling you about. And we're also going to pull the aluminum off this microtron. If you've seen my previous video, uh, that's where they came from. The Hamilton Beach microwave. Okay, let's get started on this folks. Let's get my video sitting here where you can see what I'm doing. Okay. First thing I like to do with these, you need to use side cuts. There's a little notch if you look. There's a little notch here. I don't know if you guys can see. It's not gonna let you see it very well. Okay, we're gonna pull these little notches off the base. And I'm gonna separate them little notches. So we got it there. And open this up. These are good little units for copper. They're easy to get into, really. Okay. And if you've got a drum roll, you can take and cut it off with a drum roll. But I really like to just get into them. Like so. There's all your windings, plastic gears. Okay. Pull your plastic gears out of that. Now I'll put that in plastic containers. Now, we got to get in here, get this plate, pull this plate out. See if I can do it this way then. Okay. Pop that up. There it went. There's nothing in here now that we need. This is all steel. There's your motor housing. I think that comes off pretty easy. Got number two wire came off of that. Okay, let's pull this out. Get the steel off there. I, I want that brass off of this wire. So we pulled that. Now, what I like doing here, do you use these? I'm going to try my new toys. These cable clamper or cutters. Put it in there and twist it. Oh yeah, those are nice. And there you go. We get the plastic coming off. Grab a hold of it. There you go. There's your copper. Now that motor. Motor's done. Now we have this item here. We can do two, or two, three different other ways. Uh, however long we want to do it, we can actually cut down through there with the. Uh, now the cut off wheel, I don't like messing with that because of the chances of breaking that ceramic. Let me see, I'm looking for my electrical tape because I'm going to need that. Now I do know I got tape here. That's not electrical, but that don't matter. She'll work. Nope, it ain't tape neither. Ah, run now. Okay. Right above my head, guys. Look at all those furnace just hanging right there by me. Now what I do here is I cut cover this. If that breaks, it will contain the powder or the dust and all that into there. So I don't have to mess worry about that stuff. Okay, let's end that one. Seal that up. Again, electric tape's only purpose to keep that stuff from getting airborne. So we're going to do this side here. I've never had this break on me. But there's always a first time. And I don't want to take a chance on that happening. Come on out. Where we can take and squeeze that together. To seal that. Let's go back. There we go. Now that's done. Now we got a safety handle, 
If it breaks, then it ain't gonna bother me. <laughs> now I'm I'm gonna do it this way. I've done it this way before. We're just gonna break them loose. That's just sheet aluminum we're taking off. Where's my? There it is. That's just sheet aluminum, guys. So, but I just want that copper in here. Takes a little bit of time to get them off, but hey, you know, yeah, I, I'm not only saving that copper, but I'm also saving that aluminum, so it's a little bit of weight, not much. Weight's not what not. I don't always play that, depending on how difficult that stuff is to me. This is coming off halfway decent. I ain't got an issue with it. There. Let's try this one this side now. Roll this off the other way. Oh, don't want to come out that way. Okay, there. There it goes. Now, let me get it rid of this, put this in the sheet aluminum. Now, what we got to do here, this is the copper piece I was talking about. We're going to cut this off. I'm going to see if I can do it with my journal. Okay, I normally don't do it this way, but I want to try. <laughs> I won't do it again this way, though. There. I like the way it comes apart, actually. There. Oh, that's a little warm. Phew.
And that's why I thought it was in there. Gonna hold that. I'm gonna work this on off. This is why we taped that off, remember? Look at that. Copper wire right there. It's the number one copper. Let's go ahead and see if we can pop this off the rest of the way. I see what it's done. Okay, I see how they're putting this on there. There. That go in ten. Nice piece of copper sitting in there. Number one copper. Oh, it would have been number one. Still gonna be number one. A little bit of solder right there. There. I can't believe that. Yep, still got the metal there. There it is. Now. Huh. There is the plate. That's copper coated steel. But if you look, nice hunk of copper, number two copper. We'll cut this around here. I'm going to make, put you through watching me do that. Normally I use my cutoff wheel. I just chop it with a four inch die grinder. That's the first time I've done that. So, that would be my last time doing that. But hey, it worked. Okay guys, that's what I do with them. That's your Megatron, Magnetron, excuse me. Uh, again, be very careful when you're tearing these apart. Uh, do not break that there ceramic. Uh, and we'll go from there. Uh, thank you. And uh, you guys keep me safe scrapping. Until next time, we'll see you then.